Joined by Frankie Corrado. Frankie, the Leafs' goal song saga has been a mess. They finally decided to move on, and the change lasted exactly one game. So with goal songs now in the news, we want you to list it. Being the music guy that you are, and we know you are, give us your top five goal songs in the league. All right, Gino, before we get going on the list, we need to constitute a few of the prerequisites that make a good goal song. Number one, has to get the energy going in the building. Number two, you have to have some kind of crowd engagement involved. And number three, bonus points if you can have a hometown flair associated with that song. So why don't we get the list going? Coming in at number five, the Dallas Stars. song was custom made for the Dallas Stars from the heavy metal band Pantera, specifically made for them in 1999. The band members were actually really good friends with players on the team, and they made this song for the team en route to their Stanley Cup victory in 1999. It's a great song. It gets the crowd involved. Dallas has one of the most sneaky, undercover, loudest crowds in the league. Coming in at number four, the Nashville Predators. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. It's perfect for the Nashville Predators. Tim McGraw and Faith Hill have been big time ambassadors for this team. And it has that country music flair that we know Nashville does oh so well. And this song and this team really got put on the map with their 2017 run to the Stanley Cup Finals. Coming in at number three, the Seattle Kraken. Lithium by Nirvana, one of the great grunge rock songs of that generation. And you think about the hometown flair that this has, one of the greatest rock bands in the history of the world from this area. You incorporate a song that the crowd can chant with. It's a great song. The Seattle Kraken have done a lot of things well since entering the league. Picking a goal song might be near the top of the list. Number two, the Chicago Blackhawks. <laughs> If you were a Vancouver Canucks fan from, oh, I don't know, 2007 to 2010, you hear this song in your nightmares. And that is the sign of a great goal song. Yes, the team was very good throughout those years, but the amount of times Chicago beat up on Vancouver, the players and the fans did not want to hear this song anymore. Finally, the Canucks won in 2011, but this song has it all. It has a little bit of fan interaction and the energy in the building when this song gets going. I'll tell you what, I can't wait for Connor Bedard to light the lamp for the first time at the United Center. And coming in at number one, the New York Rangers. This song has been in the mix at MSG for over 25 years. Gino, the song is called Slapshot. <laughs> now, a lot of Rangers fans thought that this song was a curse for the team because they won the Stanley Cup, and then they didn't get back to the finals until 2014. And this song was introduced the year after they won the Stanley Cup. They still haven't won one. They got to the finals. They lost. But I'll tell you what. Madison Square Garden, when the Rangers score a goal and everyone starts chanting to this song, there's not many better scenes in hockey. The New York Rangers have an absolute classic on their hands. Frankie, I love your top five list. That's brilliant. I'm assuming that Hall & Oates would not have made the list if that was still a Leaf song right now? No, it would not. Fair enough. Okay, let's have some fun, and this is going to be fun. We know you're loving music, and if not for hockey, your chosen profession probably would have been, well, to play the role of a DJ Frankie C. We had to dig into the archives to find this actual pic of you working a big festival. If you were in charge, I love this video, what should the Leafs' new song be? Gino, I'm really happy you asked me. And since we're talking about being a DJ, I actually brought a little something for you before I make nice. this pick. And I know it's not the proper headwear, but we're getting in the mood here, okay? And DJ Frankie C is here to pick what I believe 
the new goal song for the Maple Leafs should be. And I think it should be One More Time by Daft Punk. One more time, we're gonna celebrate, yeah. oh yeah. Listen, it may be a weird, obscure choice, but something about the beat of the song, the, fa the fact that the fans can be chanting one more time, maybe that leads into a Go Leafs Go chant. As you know, at times the Scotiabank Arena is a little sleepy. Anything you can possibly do to get fan engagement more and more involved, I like this song, this would be my pick. And if we were doing personalized goal songs at TSN, you better believe I'm picking one more time by Daft Punk. We have created a monster. We're calling them DJ Frankie C, but there have to be some better suggestions out there. Don't forget to like it, subscribe, and please leave a comment. We're dying to hear what you think about this.